Hello and welcome. Today we're going to try and track a storm using amateur radio gear. Hello and welcome. Uh, it's Sunday the I think it's the third of March uh, in the UK. Um, well, it's third of March of everywhere, I think, isn't it? Um, there's a storm building up in the UK. It's travelling uh, upwards from the south up into the southwest, and then it'll work its way across the Midlands where I live. So I've decided today I'm still going to go to go out. Um, I, I'm not going to travel too far up onto a, a muddy hill somewhere because that would be a, a bit silly there's weather warnings out at the moment so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm spending the day doing a little bit of uh, storm tracking so uh, since last night I've been tracking the satellite using NOAA satellites um, I today I've been trying to oops, today I've been trying to track the satellite using WeFax weather but because I've taken down my big aerial, it means that I'm not really getting the WeFax signal in strong enough. But I'm I'm going to go out uh, to actually go to a piece of high ground. I'm going to see if I can get some um, weather data over APRS. So today is let's go out into a storm. Let's try and track it using the equipment that we've all got. Last time I was here, I managed to catch some APRS weather uh, data. So we're hoping that uh, I can get a good viewpoint from here, watch the storm come in for the next couple of hours, and just try and capture a little bit of the uh, APRS. <sighs> right. We're getting a few packets through. I, uh, I have to admit, filming is uh, really difficult. The, um, the action camera has all steamed up inside of its casing. It's started to close in now, and it's really blustering across. So, um, yeah, so it's really, it's really giving it some now. So, uh, I've collected a few packets from here, but I'm not going to stand here. Um, because I'm getting soaked and it's getting cold. I'm going to head back to the car and uh, set up uh, the APRS from inside there and then see um, uh, see what else we can pick up from there. It's one of those trips out where everything is going wrong at the moment. The uh, My um, action camera uh, is all steamed up. I've uh, dropped one of my uh, mobile whip antennas on the way up so I'm going to pick that up on the way back it's come out of my bag um, and trying to operate the uh, the cameras and the APRS is is rather is rather uh, rather challenging so we're heading back to the car get a cup of tea and uh, a bit more APRS and then I might do a little bit of two meters as well so uh, yeah the uh, you can tell that the storm's heading in the weather's really changing here now quite rapidly so I'll uh, see you in a minute. Everything, everything's steamed up. I put up a, a, it's a DX Commander, uh, it's a 7 meter one. I've put on the Slim Jim, uh, which is basically I've strapped it next to uh, next to the car on a drive over mast. So I'm picking up uh, quite a number of uh, APRS packets. I'm hoping uh, some of these packets will be weather data. Uh, so um, I'll be checking that in a few minutes. Uh, hopefully we'll get some decent um, weather reports in via APRS 
the weather's really closing in now. Visibility is down to uh, only a matter of a few metres, so the weather is changing rapidly up here. Um, uh, I've got a two metre radio as well next to me. Uh, uh, so here's the APRS, uh, and I've also got on the uh, mag mount, I've got my two metre as well. Yeah, well, we're still here. Um, bit, a bit drier now. It was it was really rough out there. Uh, I found my um, I dropped a mobile uh, whip antenna. Um, the weather ones. Um, you can tell there's a little. It's recording, isn't it? Uh, there's a little WX on this display. Um, so that you can um, scroll across. Um. So, I mean, at the moment, this particular station, uh, which is south east from here, uh, it's about 60 kilometres away, is only registering, according to this, no rain at the moment, and only three, three kilometres per hour um, uh, wind, so I'm not sure how accurate all this is for this particular station. So, getting lots of packets in at the moment. But only uh, this particular station uh, for the uh, the weather at the moment. Secure, 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 secure. This is two Echo Zero, Echo Zulu Tango Mobile. Yeah, two Echo Zero, Echo Zulu Tango. Checking through this uh, um, frequency is, is in use. Uh, nothing heard. Uh, yep, yeah, this is um, two E Zero EZT Mobile. I think we've also got Steve M Zero YZY. Hi, I haven't forgot you. <laughs> no, I haven't forgot you, mate. Uh, ODZ. Yeah, no, no worries, mate. No, it's 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 one of those days. I'm um, I'm currently. Carl, so uh, seventy three for me. Thanks for the contact. Yeah, no worries, mate. Uh, have a good day. Lovely uh, to have a chat with you. I did see your post on Facebook yesterday that you got some contact. Oh, this is two e zero e z t mobile from Malcop in Cheshire Q R Z. Yeah, starting to um, pick up for this chap as well, about 60 kilometres away. So, uh, weather is now um, definitely coming down here. Um, collected quite a number of APRS uh, packets. Um, quite a few from the, the weather station and... Um, it does seem to be picking up some changes in the weather at 60k from here. Uh, it's difficult to know about that station uh, to see what kind of setup they've got, how exposed they are as a weather station. But the weather here is absolutely is, is rapidly changing um, and it's closing in quite a lot now. So we're going to take down the this uh, antenna. It's time to go home now. Um, slightly disappointed with the uh, the the APRS um, weather activity. There was only one weather station, so it was fun anyway. Playing about with uh, some APRS, um, sent out a few uh, a few beacons. I um, I have I did say that I will revisit uh, APRS in a bit more detail in the in the future video. I think it's uh, one of those. Um, activities in the hobby that really interest me. That's it for now guys and uh, look forward to catching you on the next video so bye bye for now.